this is Mantep, and we're going to play some uh, Miasmata, I think that's how you pronounce it. If I'm wrong, you can uh, correct me. Um, apparently I played the game before, but I don't recollect how the game is, or what the game is, because I got it from uh, Steam Deal. I tried it for a little bit, and I haven't really fully experienced the game, so I guess I should... Uh, yeah, I was going to start recording here and see actually how the game is fully. And uh, I guess I'll start on empty because, yeah, I'm on day two on that one. Alright, let's start empty. In a different place in time. Her name is Robert Hughes, I think that's how you pronounce it. You awake on the shores of a mysterious island. You have come to this island in exile. Oh yeah, I remember this game a little bit. You're on an island and you gotta... Yeah, I won't spoil it, but... You are suffering from a plague, a disease from which you soon will die. This island is home to a research outpost. Conclave of enlightened men searching for a cure. Discover the cure and survive. Keyword survive. That's the premise of the game. You gotta survive. An island, you know. It's cast away all over again. And this is an indie game, so expect there to be some weird glitches if there is any. Overall, you know, it's not like insane, but the graphics are pretty, pretty decent. You know, the water looks fairly real for the most part. And uh, I'm trying to get used to the controls here. The guy's kind of wobbling around. Here's a boat with a paddle. All right, butterfly. Can we catch the butterfly? Oh, we can check the time though. We can check the time. Alright, so... Press tab to open your journal. Okay, sure. Your journal provides you with your health status, medicine, inventory, and objectives. It also includes all the notes you collect and research you perform on the island. Click on the tabs at the top of the journal and explore the various sections. For you say that you Page. Press H, uh, close this, okay. So you, so you turn the page. Use the scroll wheel, right? Is that what? I don't know what that is. I thought I meant right middle mouse there to zoom in. But I can read it from here, so it's fine. Alright, discovered the plague cure. Health okay. Okay, it shows my health and everything here. So how do I close this again? Okay, that's how you zoom in, look at close to it. <laughs> Holy hell. Alright, can I... Okay, alright, I'm done looking at this. <laughs> I think I forgot the... Pr oh, it's tab, that's right. Stupid me. Okay, guy, we gotta find the plague cure. Oh, right now we're rocks. Can you run? Yep, you can sprint. Alright. I like this, you know, the mysteriousness of the island. Don't know what's gonna happen. Quiet. I don't know, it's, I just like the vibe. Feeling alone. It's almost nostalgic. There's a note on the table in the shed. Take it with left mouse button. That's what that means, okay. And it's all bloody. That's Is that supposed to be blood? Alright, well, I'll... <laughs> the blood doesn't look, uh, convincing, but, you know. That blood memo about the cure. Bloody memo. From Professor Dag... Dag... Daglas? To Dr. Sanchez. Subject play cure. 
Dear Hollow, my tests have been successful. We have a cure. Begin immediate synthesis of tricordantrazine by combining the following agents. Agent X, primary antibiotic. Agent Y, antitoxin. Agent Z, adjuvant. A single injection will safely eliminate all traces of plague growth within 4 12 hours. So, okay. Am I. Do I have the plague? Alright, it's in my notes, so. I'll look at it later. What? Do I have a plague and I have to cure for myself? So someone stabbed this guy in the back. You know, this. It's supposed to be blood, but that's it. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. I was hoping I can grab the knife out of his back, but you know, you know, common sense to grab the knife for protection. But you know, this is a game. It's an indie game, so I'm not gonna complain too much. Ooh, pretty music. All right, it's this half-built cabin that someone built. And okay, I guess it's a laboratory. Sure, why not? Like, shitty job on the cabin, maybe, like, half assed it, because, you know, if it rained, you'd be fucking soaked. Wow, I think I could do simple math on the chalkboard. <laughs> You're being watched. That's awesome to know. C5, H6, N2, O4. I'm not sure if I'm gonna need that information. This is the synthesis station. Press H to learn more. Sure, why not? The stations allow you to create medicines and tonics from the specimens you discover on the island. To use the synthesis station, place a specimen on at least one tray using left mouse button. Left, left mouse button, sorry. Then look at the distillation rig and press left mouse button again to attempt synthesis. If the synthesis of the medicine was successful, the item will materialize on the yield tray. You'll find that some medicines can be created from a single specimen, while others are created within two. But two. So I gotta use the station. Since this tray B. All right, I'm not sure how this works actually. I think these bottles are all empty, maybe. The time. This is the research station. Press H to learn more. All right, there's more to it. Research stations allow you to discover in any important medi medicinal characteristic a specimen may have. To use a research station, place your specimen on the tray using the left mouse button. If you have more than one item in your hand, you may need to press it multiple times to cycle to your desired specimen. Now look at the microscope and press left mouse button for the second time to research. The research will be formed, the results will be documented in the journal. Okay. I don't have any specimens, I don't think, so can't do much for that. Oh, okay. I, oh, oh. Oh, he's leaving some for later? Okay, cool. Health slow. Okay, I'm weak though. Probably because I have a plague. Yeah, I got a cure. Storage bin. Alright, so I guess I gotta find. What is that? Is that a needle? Oh, I can't do anything with it. Alright, let's go search for some agents. Try and make a cure. Take plants and fungi by pressing left mouse button. Okay. Is this one? Hey! Hello! I discovered a white pink vial. Viola. A typical example in the viola. Viola? I guess viola genus. This flower is white and pink in color. Sure. Do I take it back to the cabin? I mean, the laboratory? I wonder if it turns dark at some point. Do I need to find a place to sleep? 
Anyways. Can I keep this somewhere? Okay, cool. I got mixed specimens, I'm pretty sure, so I'm gonna start looking. looking for more specimens, different kinds. moving for a second there. Find fresh water to drink. Since you are stricken with... Okay, I do have a plague. Since I'm stricken with plague, you will become dehydrated very quickly. There are fresh water lakes and ponds all over the island. Press left mouse button when you're looking down the water edge to drink. This will also fill up your canteen for further use. you notice that the sea around the island is salt water. Which you cannot drink. Oh, well, yeah. Makes sense. Can I kill a bird? Can I? No. Okay. I thought I could eat the bird. I think I have to eat something too at some point. Wait. Alright. My health is good so far, so I don't think I need water again. In here. It's in here. Nothing. Okay. Let's check this little cabin. Savory game by lighting candles, lanterns, campfires, and urns. Okay, so. Oh, save that. Cool. A map. Statue. Okay. Laboratories. Okay. I'm at this cabin right here. Laboratory is back here. It's like cabin in front of me. Eventually, there's this other cabin and a statue. Alright. This bed's to recuperate strength and also save your game. They look rotten, but okay, I'll eat it. He can attack with an apple. I was trying to eat it, but you know. Hold on a second. Control keys. So you can't really press the button to eat something. Okay. Should I sleep to maybe get my strength up? Oh, I'll try it. I had the plague. I don't know what to do with this apple. I can't eat it. And now I have it. Alright, I need to find more shit. Actually, well, let's go back to the laboratory for a moment. I want to see what I can do with the plant I did find. That is one of the agents, and I need just to find two more. That looks like a path somewhere, but we'll see later on here. La di da, la di da. Oh, you're slow ass up the stairs. Okay, and now I got shit in both of my hands. Here, let's see. That's how you save the game. Here we go, okay. Medicines can be developed from many of the plants and fungi that are found on island. Some medicines can be created from a single plant, others are developed by combining two different types of plants together. Step so one, place one plant on tray A, or place one plant on tray A and a different type of plant tray B. Okay, did that. Step two, initiate medicine synthesis by using the distillation rig. Okay. Where's the distillation rig? Medicine 
For successful, a strange syringe vial will appear on the yield tray. Take it. Yield tray. Okay. So I use this. What the hell is that? Is that corn? Okay, it's churning. Not sure why you gotta weigh it. Mixing something with it. Okay. Sure, why not? Basic medicine! Basic medicine reduces fever for a short duration. Okay, so ibuprofen. That didn't help me anything. I got basic medicine, I don't know. I got something accomplished, but it wasn't any of the stuff I needed. Okay, let's get going here. Oh shit, it's turning dark. Or it's gonna storm me. Wow, it's actually pretty cool. Creepy at the same time, but it's pretty cool. Clouds moving in. guy as far as I know that's what I have to do right now. out your map and compass. Step 2. Observe your surroundings. Look for man-made landmarks such as statues, buildings, ruins, etc. Statue, tent, cabin. You are here. Such a landmark is also re represented by an icon on your map. It is considered known. In the diagram above, landmarks A and C are known, whereas landmark B is not. Right here. Someone's asked me how the game is. Draw St. Lawns to. Hold on a second, let me message my buddy here. That's your my bro. Alright, sorry about that. Alright. So I gotta somehow... Wait, do I... How do I... Do I have a map? get the map I don't think I have the map yet. Hey bunny. I kill your stupid ass? No. Oh, that, okay. That tells me. With your map and compass in hand, you can determine your location by using triangulation. To do this, click on two lone, known landmarks. A landmark can be a statue or a structure of some kind it is considered known if it is already represented on your map. Your crosshair will turn into a triangle if the landmark you are looking at is known. Additionally, your location will automatically be revealed whenever you are standing next to a known landmark. Okay, so to 
to this, click on two known landmarks. Landmark can be statue or structure. Yes. Okay, let's try this. I need my compass out too. No, hello. Oh, a second. So what I do? Just find the size of that map. It looks like it's a big world. <laughs> Look at that. All this area. Oh boy. Statue way up there too. I think there's a lot more to this game than I thought. All right, we're gonna go back and save. Oh, cool! Hey, pick up the damn thing. So I can grab it. Oh. Okay. What the hell? Did I pick up rocks? Oh, I'm picking up rocks, okay. Alright, hold left click to throw something. Okay, I get it. Alright. Can hardly boo for goddamn. Okay, let's see if I can save it here. Alright, it's a quick, uh. See how the game is at the start here. Gonna take a break right now, but. I'll be uploading more to the game later on, you'll see. If anything creepy actually happens, I think there is some creepy aspects of the game we haven't seen yet. And yeah, until then, uh, until next time, I hope you liked. If you liked, uh, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Alright, bye for now.